Welcome or welcome back to Tiny Help at C Square. In this example, we have a cube, the one you see it here in, in the picture, and each side measure 4.1 centimeter. So the length, the width, and the height of this cube are the same, obviously, 4.1 centimeter. And its mass, the mass of this cube which I'm going to call it M, is 145.7 grams. Find the density of the cube. And down here you, need, you see a formula which says D, which stands for density in my case, equals the, the mass M over the volume. Uh, be careful, this D in some other uh, area will be called rho, a Greek letter. But in this case, I'm going to use the letter D, which stands for density. As you notice here, we know the mass. The only thing we have to find is this volume. And how do we find the volume of this cube? The volume of the cubes or any other rectangular prism, or any other prism, in fact, is area of the base times the height. Area of the base here is 4.1 times 4.1, which is 16.81. centimeter square and the volume will be this base 16.81 times this height of 4.1 again centimeter so the volume will be 68.91 cubic centimeter of course this volume can be found just doing 4.1 to the third power. That's the simplest way. I prefer to use this area of the base times the height. And now we can move back to the density because we know the mass. The mass is given to us is 145.7 grams. And now we know the volume 68.921 cubic centimeter. So we just have to do a simple division 145.7 divided by 68.921 and end up with 2.11 and I need to round it to the nearest hundred so I'm gonna stop to the third decimal 4 gram per cubic centimeter so if we round it to the nearest hundred how it says we're gonna have 2.11 one one grams per cubic centimeter and that's it if you enjoyed this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you